I would like to admonish church people, wherever you are, in any country, in any community, in any nation, in any part of the world. This is the moment we can go to church. Some of us, for four months, you have not been able to go to church. Now opportunity has been given to go to church. But the challenge is that people are saying they are afraid that when they get to the church, they will catch the disease, COVID. But the question is, sometimes you sit in a vehicle, you are going to a place or your hometown, you spend three hours in the bus. You are not afraid. You are not scared of the COVID. You go to work. You spend eight solid hours at a workplace. You are not afraid of the COVID. You go to other places and then you meet people and you meet friends. You spend two hours, one hour. You are not scared of the COVID. And then you go to other areas. But yet when it is time for church, just the one hour or one and a half hours or whatever, then you are beginning to convince yourself that, that you are going to cut the disease. Something is wrong. There is an error there. The question is, is, if you can go to the workplace for eight hours and you are not scared of the disease, you can travel two hours and three hours or seven and four hours in the vehicle and you are not scared of the disease. Look at the market. Look at how crowded it is. Yet you are able to spend some time there and move on to the next place or not, whatever you want to do. And yet you are not afraid that at the, any part of the market, you will cut the disease. And when it comes to church, one and a half hours, then you are scared. No, there is an error. The enemy wants to put fear in the life of church people. And this is the moment we must rise up to go back to church. If you can work eight hours at your workplace, I guarantee you the church is a safe place. The church rather has put in place all the necessary protocol. I bet you the church protocol is much more detailed than some of our hospitals. The church protocol is much more detailed than some of the organizations. And therefore, if you are finding a place of safety, it is the church. I speak to every church person. Like Jesus told the man at the pool of Bethesda, Arise, take up your Bibles now and go to church. Put on your dancing shoes. Go back to church. Let me see you in church celebrating the goodness of the church. You are more safer in the church than outside. Let us now liberate ourselves and take away the fear and come to church. Let's see you in church.